It's time. It's time to free your mind, body and soul. Body and soul. With set free radio. With set free radio. Set free radio, hosted by Frankie D. And Miss Rochelle, bringing you the highest in indie urban inspirations. Bringing that fire with hip hop, reggae, dance, and contemporary. Set free. you right here on set free radio feeling real good i got me frankie d my girl miss rochelle how you doing over there lady i'm doing good and tonight we have a very special guest on the line joining us mr alan payne is joining us live tonight alan payne how are you sir i'm fine how are you today i'm doing great alan thanks for asking we're very glad to have you on the show alan for some of our listeners who may not be familiar with who you are why don't you go ahead and let them know exactly who alan payne is uh, I really don't know how to answer that question. I'm an actor. Uh, I, I represent God. I represent life, beauty, creativity. Uh, that's about it. All right, we got your lock right here. Set Free Radio, Frankie D, Ms. Rochelle, and our special co-host, Alan Payne from TBS's House of Pain. Look, don't go nowhere. We got to get into the music. We'll be right back at you. Bringing you the best in today's urban inspirations. Ladies and gentlemen. It's Set Free Radio. Set Free Radio. With Frankie D and Ms. Rochelle. Bringing you nothing but the best in urban inspirations. You tuned in to Set Free Radio where we're feeling real good on this Friday night. If you don't know, this is me, Frankie D, on the MIC. And to the right of me, I got my girl, Miss Rochelle. And speaking of special guests for the night, we got a special co-host on the line. If you're just tuning in, we got Alan Payne from TBS's House of Pain hanging out with us and doing this thing on this good Friday. Now, check this out, Alan. Once again, we're glad to have you on the line. But I got a quick question for you. Many people remember you from hit movies like Jason's Lyric, New Jack City, and also how you played the character Lance on the hit show, The Cosby Show. Tell us about, you know, how things were back then and how far you came with a lot of the success and the accomplishments in your life. Well, actually, I don't really view uh, this creative journey that way as far as accomplishments or what. I don't really look at it that way. I, I see it as uh, a creative in life that, you know, you discover that you have these gifts and then you, you try and hone these gifts, these, these crafts that you receive. And then uh, the opportunity to express them comes through means of, of work and, you know, just living. And uh, for me, you know, they started years ago on the stage and they've continued to, uh, to actually be expressed and the opportunity to to be creative and grow through films and television. And even now, you know, uh, just doing comedy. What's interesting is that the effect that these things have on people in the community and the people that actually patronize them is, is actually what amazes me and makes it so exciting because currently, you know, doing for the last five years, I've been shooting House of Pain with Tyler Perry. And, uh, you know, the way that that has transformed people and their lives and, and been a real blessing for myself and for people who watch the audience and the way that children respond uh, to my character who was a very solid, loving husband and father. So uh, it's just interesting to see how these things affect people's lives. All right. Right now you're tuned in to Set Free Radio. It's Frankie D, Miss Rochelle. And as you're listening now, we got our special co-host, Alan Payne from TBS's House of Pain. Right now we got to get back into the music. But look, don't go nowhere. We got more coming your way from Alan Payne and myself and Miss Rochelle. 
Set Free Radio. Frankie D and Miss Rochelle. Set Free Radio. You're hanging out right here with myself, Miss Rochelle, and Frankie D. Also with our special co-host on the line, Mr. Alan Payne. Alan Payne, let's talk about the hit television series, The House of Payne, whom you play CJ, a very handsome, might I add, hardworking father supporting his family. Talk to us about CJ and The House of Payne television show. CJ's father, like you said, he's a, he's a committed father, a husband, uh, works very hard in his career path, and uh, God's hearing man, and uh, pretty much just kind of, you know, it's well written that way, you know, when the, Mr. Tyler Perry, you know, actually patterned him in a way so that he could be someone that even people without fathers could look to and say, you know, he is kind of who some of us aspire to be as opposed to, you know, who we actually are. Like we, we do have fathers like that who are very loving, caring, committed, and uh, husbands and career men. And, uh, but, uh, you know, this guy is, uh, he's a, he's a solid human being. You know, that's, that's the best I could say about him. You're chilling with us, Miss Rochelle, Frankie D, and Alan Payne from the hit television show House of Payne. Also, the hit stage play Marriage Material, due to come to Fresno at the Saroyan Theater May 5th. Don't leave us. We're hanging out right here on this Good Friday edition of Set Free. You guys stay right there. Bringing you the best in today's urban inspirations. It's Set Free Radio. Set Free Radio. With Frankie D and Miss Rochelle. We want to thank everyone for joining us tonight on this Good Friday edition of Set Free Radio. We have our special co-host on the line joining us tonight, Mr. Alan Payne. Alan Payne, there's a question I wanted to ask you about um, giving advice to our youth. There's a lot of youth out there who are looking to go into acting school and uh, they may be aspiring to become the next Alan Payne. What advice can you give them that will help them further their career in the acting business? I would say don't aspire to be the next anyone that uh, your true gifts and talents uh, all come from inside of you. And if you have the ability to be, this is a, this is a very daunting, very arduous career as an actor. And if you have aspirations to be an actor, uh, or whatever it is, you, you know, a lot of it has to do with where your gifts and talents lie. So I don't think that anyone should aspire to be the next individual who has already exist in a plane, but actually to allow God's gifts and talents to actually allow uh, express themselves through your life and your living, through your creativity, through your spirit, and through your actions. And uh, so there's a lot of discipline, there's a lot of focus, and there is a lot of commitment to whatever it is that you, you know, that you have aspirations to be, whether it be on the stage uh, or on, you know, in, in, a, in a hospital as a, as a doctor, whether it be a businessman or an engineer, a lawyer, whatever those aspirations are, that they all come from inside of you. Um, what we are are just examples as to what discipline can be, but there are also examples as to what failure is and how discipline and hard work, you know, sometimes, you know, luck plays a very large part in in having success. So you have to work very hard and diligently to create anything, and it, it all comes from within. It's, it's not a competition, and there's no comparison to anyone who has come before or anyone on your periphery that you may be, you know, working chronologically as one of your peers that you have to really get inside your true spirit and find your best, your greatest, and allow that to drive your life forward. Great advice, Alan. What do you think about that, Frankie? Well, I mean, like you said, you definitely want to do you, work hard. I mean, that's the main thing. A lot of cats get out there in the industry and they try to sound like somebody else or look like somebody else or be that person. But nobody needs somebody on stage doing an impression. 
use what God gave you to, you know, aspire for whatever you want, whether it's acting, directing, you know, being behind the scenes, whatever you want to do, you can do it. And that's great advice, Alan. But right now, let's get back into the music. You're logged on to Set Free Radio, whether you're listening here at 88.1 FM. And don't forget to tell a friend if you're out there. We can also be heard on the World Wide Web at www.kfcf.us. That's www.kfcf.us. Let's get back into the mix. Set Free Radio. Frankie D and Miss Rochelle. Set Free Radio. Your lock right here on Set Free Radio. It's me, Frankie D, Miss Rochelle, and our special co-host for the evening, Mr. Alan Payne of TBS's hit TV show, House of Pains. We definitely are having a great time up in here. Thanks, everybody, for calling in and just checking in on us, talking with us, and just having a good time on this good Friday. You know what I mean? But jumping back into the interview, Alan, once again, thanks for coming on. Check this out. A question I have for you is... Let's talk about the hit stage play marriage material that's coming our way. I know you're sharing the stage with people like Jill Marie Jones, T. Biles from TLC, Michael Collier, and a lot of other major performers. The name, the, the roster goes on and on. Talk to us and tell us a little bit about your role and how that's impacting on stage. Well, I play a character who is in love with his girlfriend and wishes to marry her, and he takes her on a retreat that helps them. It's kind of like a couple's retreat that allows them to work through some of their problems. Uh, but as they get there, they, as soon as they arrive, they find that uh, their friends and, and actually Jill's ex is present at the same place. So we wind up going through a bit of drama, some, a lot of comedy and some drama at the same time. It's very entertaining and all the performers are extremely talented. You know, very funny, talented people. So I'm, uh, I'm, I'm happy to be on the stage with these people there. You know, it's fun. It's just fun for me. To do this kind of thing is really just a lot of fun. I wouldn't do it if it weren't, if it weren't fun. You're tuned in to Set Free Radio with Frankie D, Miss Rochelle. And if you're just tuning in, right there on the line, we got... Alan Payne from TBS's hit show, House of Pains, enjoying ourselves on this good Friday. And, yo, check it out. If you want to hear something from us or you got any requests, definitely hit us on the request line, 559-266-8888. That's 559-266-8888. Shoutouts, whatever you need. It's good Friday, baby. It's all good. So give us a holler. But let's get back into the music. Set Free Radio. Bringing you the best in today's urban inspirations. It's Set Free Radio. Set Free Radio. With Frankie D and Miss Rochelle. This is Set Free Radio with Frankie D, Miss Rochelle, and kicking back with an exclusive. We got TBS's Alan Payne coming your way from the House of Pain. Huge show. If you don't know what the show is about, it's basically produced by Tyler Perry. I know many of you may have heard of Tyler Perry. Huge stage play producer, movie producer. I mean, just got a slew of things going. So check that out on TBS. And speaking of getting back into Alan, Alan, a question that I have is, of course, we see you on TV. We've seen you in films. We've talked about that a little bit earlier. You know, a lot of cats like to call you G Money from New Jack City. But outside of that, you know, I know you're way more than just those characters on screen. And a lot of people get caught in what you play there. What I want to talk about is the roots of the art form. You know, I want to talk to you about, you know, your acting training and what it was like to go into the, the performing arts. Talk to us a little bit about where it all began and how Alan Payne hit not just the movie screen, but the stage play. Well, you know, some of us, when you learn how to act, you get your training on the stage. It's live. It isn't film acting. Um, and when you leave school or while you're currently involved in school, you're auditioning and trying to get seen in plays. So uh, you get to perform plays in school. When you're, when you're learning your training, your training isn't done in film. Your training is done for theater. Acting is really for theater. And so when you first begin to work, your work is done on the stage. And from there, you are able to move to other mediums, whether it be television or film. If you have a career that has been as long as mine has been, you, you know, you get the opportunity to move through all these different mediums and back and forth. I started with plays. I've done everything from, 
from children's theater to off Broadway, you know, working at uh, uh, a Circle and Square repertory company in down in the village in New York, and to you know to actually have done uh, a couple of of plays like the one that I'm doing currently, which is a tour, you know, in the black theater. So you know, it's all wonderful, it's all good, but they're all different. They're all different forms and, and all different forms of acting as well as uh, the audience and the people who participate in common patronizing as well as the actors that you're working with on stage. You heard it right here first, folks. Set Free Radio, Frankie D, Alan Payne, Ms. Rochelle. Check it out. I mean, it's one thing to want to get into the movies, but you got to develop your craft, and it all starts on stage. So young folks, whether you're in high school, getting ready to go through drama, or are you transitioning up to the college level, JC, wherever you're going, get those skills, get it in on stage, because that will transition to make you even more of a, a productive actor on stage and then transition in the screen. So not everybody jumps onto the big screen. I mean, if it happens, you know that's your blessing but otherwise work on stage build your craft do it big let's get back into the music set free radio frankie d and miss rochelle set free radio Thank you for hanging out tonight with us on this special Good Friday edition of Set Free Radio with myself, Miss Rochelle, Frankie D, and our special co-host for the night, Mr. Alan Payne, who is set to hit the Fresno stage May 5th in a wonderful play called Marriage Material. Now, Alan, what can your fans expect from you in 2011 and beyond? What are some things that we can look forward to? Tell us about that. Well, we, uh, Mr. Tyler Perry and myself have just decided that we're going to do some films together that I'm going to star in. So uh, that should begin uh, very soon, sometime later on in the year. And, uh, you know, I've wrote a television show that I'm trying to get that uh, on the air. So we'll see how, you know, how successful I am at getting that done. So, you know, I'm just, uh, I'm just blessed and grateful at the same time and happy to be doing all these things and to have all these blessings arrive in my life from the time that I was 18 years old, you know. Definitely looking forward to the work that you have coming with Tyler Perry. Can't wait to do that. That is some exciting news for us here and your fans around the world. Set Free listeners, you guys, we're going to get right back into some music really quick, so stay tuned. Alan Payne, Miss Rochelle, Frankie D, Good Friday edition. Stay tuned. Bringing you the best in today's urban inspirations. It's Set Free Radio. Set Free Radio. With Frankie D and Miss Rochelle. This is Set Free Radio with Frankie D, Miss Rochelle, and we're getting ready to let our guy go tonight. If you're just tuning in, you missed a great interview with TBS's own Alan Payne of Meet the Pains. That's right, from the Tyler Perry hit show and as a matter of fact he's actually coming to Fresno in a couple of weeks with the marriage material play look Alan most people you know they, they, they're they trying to catch up with their, their favorite actor online whether it's Facebook Twitter do you even have a Facebook do you do Twitter is there a way that folk can keep up with you online no I don't really do any of that I'm a really private person I'm not really public with all that you know online you know follow me stuff uh, I, it's just really not my thing so you know, you just have to look and see if I have a film coming or a television show or if I'm on stage. All right, you heard it right here first. Set Free Radio, Alan Payne doing it big. Thanks for coming on, fam. Let's get back into the music. Set Free Radio. Mr. It's time. It's time. To free your mom. Body and soul. Body and soul. With Set Free Radio. Set Free Radio. Set Free Radio, hosted by Frankie D. And Miss Rochelle. Bringing you the highest in indie urban inspirations. Bringing that fire with hip hop, reggae, dance, and contemporary. 